an alternative to colonoscopy for those at average risk for colon cancer is the FIT test. The FIT test is a kit that you can pick up at your primary care office or it can be mailed to you. It already will have the postage included as well as a return address which will come directly to our lab. The FIT test is an at-home test for stool to detect the presence of blood. It is not a replacement for colonoscopy, but it is an acceptable form of colon cancer screening, again, if you're at average risk. Inside the FIT test, you will have a little collection vial, a little plastic bag for the collection vial to be mailed back in, and you'll have some easy to understand instructions as well. If you speak Spanish, we can also get these instructions uh, to you in Spanish. There will also be a folded up piece of tissue paper inside this kit and we'll describe to you what that's going to be used for uh, in just a minute. When you take your kit home, it doesn't matter what time of day you decide to test, but you do need to make sure that um, you have everything out and available. We have a number that you can call to in case you get confused or need assistance. The first thing you'll do when you do your FIT test is to take everything out as I've done here. You will raise the lid on your toilet, or the seat of your toilet, and unfold this sheet of paper. This sheet of paper has two stickers, one on each side, and you'll pull the tape off of that. That can be hooked to the side of the commode. Then you will lower the toilet seat down on the tissue paper. Once you've had your bowel movement, then you will take this collection tube and simply unscrew it. I do recommend that you put your name and date of birth on here first before you collect your specimen because sometimes it can smear and the lab will not process this if, unless you have your name and date of birth on it. So simply unscrew the vial and stick it in to the specimen in six different spots, making sure that the end of it is covered. Then you'll simply screw it back on, make sure you screw it on tightly so the liquid won't leak out, and just toss it a few times. Once you've done that, you can flush this paper. It will go down the toilet without any problem unless you have a low water flushing toilet. Then it's not recommended that you do that. After you've collected it, made sure your name and date of birth is on the test vial. You'll simply put it in the plastic bag, seal it, put it in the postage paid envelope. Make sure you seal that by pulling off this tape and folding it over and then put it in the mail. You can put it in your regular mail, mailbox. You don't have to take it to the post office. Postage is already paid for you. If you have any questions about your FIT test, feel free to call me at 606-408-1497.